Today, the six million Jews killed during the Holocaust are being remembered. And in tonight's Never Stop Learning, students at one school got to hear firsthand what it was like to live through that. Rushing back toward these bridges, going across the bridges and into Poland. And this was the retreating Polish army because the Germans were coming. Well, that is 88-year-old Walter Ziffer, a Holocaust survivor, describing the moment the Nazis moved into his hometown. The retired Mars Hill College professor shared his experiences with a packed auditorium at Apple Valley Middle School. It's part of Holocaust Remembrance Day. He talked about how he was torn from his family at the age of 14 and sent to seven concentration camps over four years. What happened a long time ago was really tragic, and knowing all their stories, many people died, they were killed, and it's amazing that there was people that survived, so it's important that we still remember them. It's a very important part of history, and to make sure that it doesn't happen again or anything like that. Ziffer became one of 300,000 European Jews who brought their stories to the United States after the war. He settled in Nashville, Tennessee in 1949, finished high school, and later graduated with a degree in engineering from Vanderbilt University. What a privilege for those kids to get to hear from someone who lived that history. That's right. Made it through firsthand.